Hey guys, so this is a special intro for just YouTube video. If you are watching this on YouTube, then this is an intro uh, specifically made for that because uh, this particular entire video, which you will see after the intro, is available inside my Digital Pratik University, which is absolutely for free to learn digital marketing. Uh, currently, we are standing, as you can see right over here, we are standing at more than 11,000 plus students in just 15 days. I launched this university on 31st March because of lockdown and I wanted people to learn uh, digital marketing for free and this is forever free all right not just for lockdown this is forever free so inside uh, this I have this model as well so let me just uh, move this a little bit over here so in that inside this model I have this uh, Facebook and Instagram ads course where there is in-depth knowledge over here which is 100% free which people are charging dollars for uh, and over here I explained something in like 30 minutes uh, super detailed understanding of Facebook business manager and Facebook ads manager so that you uh, are, are safe from this event when Facebook bans your account, all right? And because of which I just did this particular video and uh, the reason why I'm showing you over here my Instagram profile is once, yeah, please come to my profile, don't hit the follow button, just consume my content, I bet you'll follow me. <laughs> and second of all, I, so I just had this particular video uh, made this morning and this is like recent one. The reason why I'm doing this particular YouTube video is because of this. So if I go into my stories in the past 24 hours, like uh, before 12 hours itself. So if I now stop over here, all right? So 12 hours ago, you can see on the top, like right over here, 12 hours ago, 12 hours ago, uh, right in the middle of night, like 1.35 AM, uh, what happened was uh, my ad account got disabled, all right? It got suspended. And now I can actually remove uh, this particular Instagram profile from here. And now uh, coming back to this particular one, let me just remove why is this not going on? I hate this technical stuff. Oh, fine. Finally, it has gone. Bingo. So right over here inside this module, I'm just clearly stating that the way the best structure to follow for creating your business manager and ads account so that in case your ad account gets disabled and I'll show you a process as well now step by step that how you can recover how you can try or appeal uh, to Facebook support team that how you can recover the account and in case if they doesn't um, uh, d doesn't allow you to recover that account and they permanently suspend your account then what are the things you need to take care of before happening all right and that is what i have shown in this particular video so make sure if you are watching this on youtube video uh, then make sure you go through this digitalpratikuniversity.com and enroll in this course and just go through this uh, video where i am showing you step by step how you can do now in case if you have watched this you have already applied and even if you have got banned or if you have not applied and if you have gone back uh, got banned then what you need to do so that is what i'm going to discuss over here so right now this is 16th april so i'll refresh this page as well so that you get to know that yes it is 16th april and right now the time is 155 uh what is the time right now it is 155 pm ist all right so i'm in Andhra, gujarat india so 155 pm so before 12 hours this happened and what i did i'll show you that so whenever that happens the first thing which you will see on your ads account would be a banner which will say that your ad account has got disabled and they will have appeal button so you can click on that appeal button or if you don't see anything like that you can go ahead and visit facebook.com slash help slash contact slash a couple of numbers I'll provide this particular link in the description box below this video so you can find that link click on that link if you have got banned you can come on this page this page will have all the details where you can request a review of restricted ad account and the first question which they'll ask is is this your account uh, yes it was my account all right if it is not your account and if you don't have access you can say no and you can enter the ad account ID and you can enter a case number if you have one now in my case it was my own ad account so i said yes now if your ad account has been disabled you will see your ad account over here by default you will see your ad account over here all right the reason why i'm not able to see is my ad account has been recovered so that's a good news i'll show you how 
so the the moment you have your ad account disabled and you come to this page you'll see your ad account over here once you select your ad account just select individual option over here say why are you requesting a review you uh, are you not sure which policy was violated or maybe you think that there was unauthorized use of your ad account or any other reason if you select this you'll have to mention a couple of things which is like genuine because facebook will read this all right the support team reads this so for me it was like i was actually not sure which policy was violated because i was doing everything right uh, based on my knowledge so i was doing everything right and this is what i selected and once i selected this i clicked on send last night now the way you can see your appeal whether it has been uh, uh, whether it has been seen by facebook and whether they have approved your thing or not you can visit facebook.com/support so you can just visit facebook.com/support i'll give you this link as well where you can see your appeal which you have made so once i had submitted that form check this out i had submitted my form like this i had selected my id obviously my ad account was already there my business account was already there because it was banned last night and i was requesting a review for the reason that i am not sure which policy was violated and then right over here you can see today at 17 right so last night 1 am i submitted this request i appealed for this and right now after almost like 12 hours today at 139 they are saying hi emma so emma is like my dummy account's name hi emma we reviewed the business account again and determined that access to advertising was incorrectly disabled any of its ad accounts or ads that were affected will return to their previous status we apologize for any inconvenience thanks facebook support bingo so my ad account is now good news <laughs> is back so this is the thing which you have to do all right the only thing which you can do is contact your facebook support not your facebook support obviously contact facebook support this is the only method if somebody is saying that give me 50000 rupees i'll help you recover don't fall into that trap if somebody tells me give me 1 lakh rupees i'll get your ad account recovered there is no hack unless somebody has a close relationship inside facebook support team they might be able to do it but that is not a guarantee all right so please don't invest your money or waste your money like that this is the only method which you can do and this is the safest method and most of the times if you have not done anything wrong they will approve and they will once again get your ad account back so right now i have my ad account back but the only thing which you will notice is a couple of campaign errors or maybe ad errors and that is perfectly all right you can click on those errors if you are able to see any and then you can just click on uh, the setup error or wherever the errors are or you can click on review and publish and then select the things and everything would be once again back to normal so let me first show you that right review publish so it is asking me to fix the error for this particular campaign i click on fix error so everything is good to go everything is good to go the only thing which i have to do is i have to click on publish and i guess it should be uh, working well because they unpublish uh, the things which were active so i had this account uh, i had this campaign active while it got uh, disabled and that's the reason why it was there so now it is there and you can see there is no error all right there is no error so the only thing which you have to do is this oops once again yeah that is it so this is the only thing which you have to do now i can once again go ahead and just active the campaign so these were the two uh, uh, campaigns which were active another thing which uh, is noticeable over here is let me just go into mind map so right over here how to recover a disabled facebook ads account i just told you but there are two reasons they might disable number one is high negative feedback scores and number two is not following facebook's advertising policy now if you are into my course over here let me show you i go through facebook ads policy where it is where it is uh, yeah there you go inside the course i have this uh, complete step by step thing of understanding facebook's ads policy how you can go and what are the things which you have to take care so make sure you watch this video inside my course and second of all so obviously this point is like you you will uh, understand once you watch that video but in this video i want to discuss this high negative feedback scores what do you mean by this it means that facebook users who are seeing your advertisements on their feed or somewhere they have they get an option all right uh, they can share the feedback with the platform which is facebook so how let me show you 
whenever they see the ad they get an option like this here you go so i have two different screenshots so number one is this one this is the screenshot of the thing which you might see when your ad account gets disabled your ad account has been flagged for policy violations any ads you are running has been turned off if you believe this is a mistake please contact us so i clicked on contact us and then the procedure which i just showed you happened and second is the user all right whenever a facebook uh, user is seeing your ad they can click on this so i'll actually show you a real time example let's say if i go into facebook and if i'm scrolling on this feed so right over here you can see uh, i'm able to see this option on the top all right this option on the top where it is horizontal line so i can click on this and i can click on report ad and this is the option which needs to be submitted all right so it might be like i might just say that misleading or scam sexually inappropriate offensive violence prohibited content so this might happen uh, based on the user uh, you if if your targeting is not right and if people feel that uh, this is of no use to me and still i'm able to see this ad so maybe a couple of people who are like dicey they, they might just uh, report your ad and in that case you can actually see whether you are getting negative scores or not so this ad would be possible so if i select this if i click on preview now on the mobile news feed this is the ad so i can click on this ad preview option and select facebook post with comments so it will open up the entire facebook ad and the post along with all the comments and everything right over here all right right over here so click on any of these options click on any of the insights option and in a couple of seconds it will open up so i'll just decrease uh, the size so you can see and now click on post all right click on post and right at the bottom you will see this negative feedback option can you see this negative feedback uh, zero hide posts zero report as spam zero hide all posts zero unlike page so for me there was no negative feedback score for this particular campaign and this was the only campaign which was active when my ad account got disabled so what i thought was maybe i might have got negative feedback for my post so like i just saw this and there was no negative feedback so i thought that there might be some while uh, policy violation by my ad account and i didn't know and that's the reason why i selected that option and i requested i appealed to facebook and uh, it got recovered as you saw it got recovered so this is the step by step procedure of you uh, like like figuring out uh, what all things need to be done when your ad account gets disabled and uh, that's what i have mentioned over here all right so this is like an in depth course which you can see and if you are already enrolled in uh, like facebook and instagram ads course over here all right so what kind of value you are already having over here so you will obviously see this particular video after this one over here uh, you will see plenty of things so hope you found this video valuable if you did if you are still watching on youtube uh, then make sure you like comment and share it with your friends who might face this trouble or who might face this difficulty and also share digitalpatikuniversity.com with everyone who wants to learn digital marketing absolutely for free there is no catch no shitty sales funnel where i'll call you for premium memberships no nothing like that everything is free so visit digitalpatikuniversity.com and i'll see you inside there also i'll see you in some other video till then take care bye then as always guys stay blessed stay home it is lockdown right now and God bless you.